What's going on Clash Bashers? Rocky here today and today we're going to be checking out some mass super witch armies. We're going to be using super witches in war at Town Hall 12 going for a perfect war. We're, at, we're right on the cusp of a perfect war over here in Irritated Ram. We got some Town Hall 12 attacks left and myself and Steven we're going to try to clutch that perfect war using the mass super witches this is going to be really awesome i think super witch is going to be really strong at town hall 12 a really great attack to use but we also are going to have a nice little clip of super witches at town hall 13 uh, town hall 13 v 13 super witch bad attack so these super witches are really fun to play with they're super strong like i said at town hall 12 they're crazy but let's quit stall let's get into it guys don't forget to subscribe don't forget to leave a like let's go, go with this common keyword of the day of super witch Throw that down in the comments. I'll try to go through and heart a bunch of you guys. Show you guys some love because you guys crushed it on yesterday's video. Seriously, yesterday's video was insane. So let me go ahead and shout out a few of you guys from yesterday's video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy that. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this update. It's crazy. Let's go ahead and check out what we got in store. All right, guys. So we're going to go in with some mass super witches with some bats. We're going to test this out at Town Hall 12. I think it can work really well. Also, the perfect war is on the line here. So we got we got to do well. We got to do well. Uh, so we're going to spam our mass witches in over here. Run the wall wrecker in behind. And then we'll bat through the top side. Pretty simple, right? Let's go. Remember, you get those ma the max level super witches for Town Hall 12. So that's pretty nasty. Uh, let's get them going right here. Let's go. We got to get those big boys out. The big boys. But remember, these super witches are pretty tanky on their own. Oh, here come the big boys. Here come the big boys. Oh, I didn't make a record line. That's a pretty good line. That should be fine. Should be fine. Oh my goodness, this stuff is crushing right now. Alright, wall wrecker, open up that wall. Nice. Alright, big boys of witches, go inside. Oh, here they come, here they come, let's go. Alright, let's, uh, poison there. Let's hit the warden ability here, just to make sure our wrecker makes it through a little bit further. I'm gonna poison that. Oh no, I was late on the poison. Alright, let's go ahead and rage up through here. I mean, we should still be fine. We got a lot of stuff still up here. We can get through the singles. Oh my goodness, this is looking nice. Alright, go guys, go. Queen, get out of the range of that single. Queen, get out of the range! Alright, let's run our bats in from the top side. Our, our heroes are doing weird things here. We're gonna get that town hall down. But really, this should be crushed with the super witches. I don't think there's any question that this is crushed. Oh my goodness, super witches OP. Look at all those witches on the bottom side, all those big boys in the core. Oh my goodness, this is nice. <laughs> oh man, that's that's beautiful. That's a thing of beauty right there. We'll freeze, just to swag out the freeze. So there's one out of two. One out of two. We're going for the perfect war. This is gonna be tough. Look at those super witches go. Remember, super witches can only spawn one big boy each. We're going to try to use them on the next base. I haven't looked at the next base, but we're going to force super witches on them one way or another because I feel like they're super strong and these bases are kind of weak. So there we go. Our first three star using the mass super witches with some bats. This attack might be really nasty at Town Hall 12. There's skellies. Big boys on the king. Town Hall is going to go down here. Still has the two freezes. Warden ability. I think he's so used to the Town Hall having a Tesla that he popped his Warden ability because Steven plays Town Hall 13 a lot. <laughs> so might have been anticipating like a Gigabomb, even though there's no Gigabomb there. Which gets through there. Still two freezes, Steven. I think he's watching on stream. All right. Witch doing her thing. Getting through. Got to pop the... Or not the Witch. Queen's got to pop her ability. She gets through. Plenty of skeletons up. Plenty of big boys up, rather. Queen's still going, still have a freeze for that multi. They're gonna get through there, guys. This is looking pretty good from Steven. It's all gonna come down to me for the perfect war. I mean, technically we have two attacks, but I'm gonna try to get it with my 12 against their 12. Look at this, guys. Mass Super Witches crushing these bases. Mass Super Witches going for the perfect war. Let's go. Look at those big ones. He still has... He has six Witches left? He only lost one Witch throughout that? Whoa. 
crush and that one witch tanked an eagle shot that's crazy we're gonna get ready i'm gonna hit we're gonna try for the perfect war all right guys we're gonna go for the perfect with my 12 if we have to hit it with a 13 we will but we're hoping super witches lead us to the perfect war we're gonna hit this base right here which my town hall 10 actually got a two star on so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna quad quake open all this we're gonna bring some freezes for the singles and eagle in here we're gonna bring a siege barracks for this top side here filled with hogs we're gonna use one super witch and maybe our king over here to funnel and then everything else is just going right up the middle and we're going to try to overwhelm this base. It does have a uh, level 5 town hall, but we should be alright here, guys. So let's go for it. This is for, for the perfect war. This is for all the marbles. Make sure we're recording. We're good. Let's hit it. Mass super witches. Are they that OP at town hall 12? Let's find out. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Alright, so I'm going to put the super witch over here. While she's starting her stuff, I'm going to go ahead and quake open. Oh my god, why is my finger so, why is my finger so shaky there? All right, we're gonna let her do her thing. Big boil tank. We're just gonna let them work for a moment here. Just create this funnel. Create that nice little funnel. All right, I'm gonna throw another one in over there. We're gonna go barracks over here. I'm gonna let the barracks work momentarily. Witch, 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 king, queen, poison the clan castle. Witch, Warden. Alright, Clan Castle's going down. We'll have Hogs coming out here momentarily. Let's go ahead and rage up here to get to that Queen. King's ability. Nice. Alright, we're going to go ahead and freeze all of this right here. Hogs are out. Go ahead and freeze there. Nice. Hogs are working. Got to keep an eye on them, but they're looking pretty healthy. Let's go ahead and heal here for the hogs. Alright, everything's looking pretty good through here. Nice, nice, keep going. I'm going to hit the Warden ability here. Which, actually, we might have needed to save that, but we'll, we'll see. We'll be fine. Got tons of big boys up. Queen gets the Town Hall down. Big boys beating through a wall. Now, we know the Tornado Trap's on the back end of this base. Oh my goodness, look at all these super witches up with their big boys. Queen's coming back around. She's confused. This is looking pretty good, guys. Super witch is going to lead us to victory. Super witch is going to lead us to the perfect war. Let's go. Super witches are going to be really nasty at Town Hall 12, guys. I think this just reinforces that. I mean, yeah, these bases weren't like 100% maxed or anything. But still, look at how many witches we've had up on all these attacks. Absolutely crushing them. Those big boys getting through. How many witches do I have? I have two, four... I have six out of seven witches up also. Six out of seven witches up also. Those super witches crushing Town Hall 12 in war. Securing the perfect war for us with super witches at Town Hall 12. And we still have a Town Hall 13 swag attack. Look at that, guys. Perfect War comes in clutch. Alrighty guys, so a little bit of a bonus clip here, like I kind of mentioned at the beginning of the video. This is a Town Hall 13v13 with witches and bats. I was messing around with this, we were uh, testing out some stuff, and the Super Witch Bat Attack actually worked out pretty well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come in with a Warden Walk, I'm going to set the funnel on the bottom side. I'm going to really just let this Warden walk out and... Just be really patient here, that way I have a nice line up the middle. And then since I'm using 10 spells total, 6 for the bats and 4 for the freezes, I don't really have room for like jumps or quakes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring in a wall wrecker instead of like jumps or quakes. That way I have a line to get right up into the middle of the base. And you'll kind of see how that acts as we get through here. But the super witches have been really fun to play with. I think they're going to be really, really strong for Town Hall 12. I also mess up here and put my wall wrecker right into a storage. Don't do that. Don't put your wall wrecker right into a storage. Luckily it does doesn't hurt me here but it in that situation it could you know make your troops walk on you but luckily the record gets through uh, but yeah man I think I think these witches are gonna be nice for Town Hall 12s and situational for Town Hall 13s but pretty usable at 13 so what I did there was I popped my record my warden's ability that way the record gets all the way through and gets towards that Town Hall that way we're able to get through there or at least gets really close to the town hall, I should say. Uh, but we do have the ice golems on the clan castle, so it froze everything. Then I'm gonna go ahead and run my royal champion down here from the six o'clock position to try to get out those two wizard towers. Single's not that big of a deal with bats, but you definitely wanna try to get as many wizard towers and splash down as possible. So we freeze the single right there so she can get through. Meanwhile, in the core, we got the queen working on the eagle, working through all those defenses, those big boys just going crazy. Tornado goes off. 
but the queen gets held up here by the enemy heroes. So what I do is I go ahead and I start the bats around the outside of the base while the queen's kind of working through there and getting that scatter shot down. Freeze on the wizard tower. Obviously, anytime you're running bats, you want to make sure you freeze the wizard towers. This was really close. Uh, I, I froze. It was a little bit late there. But I do not want that wizard tower, you know, taking my bats out. But we had an, enough witches. We have enough big boys to get around the base, get through here pretty well. The last freeze goes down, and look at that, guys. Nice and crushed with, with the super witch bats. The, the witches are really fun. I'm actually pretty excited about them. I didn't test them a ton before the update came out, but I'm actually really looking forward to playing with them more, getting more experience with them, because those big boys, even against singles, like you saw that base had all singles. It didn't matter. You know, she's able to respawn more, more skellies. Uh, more big boys and it's just able to get through and three star the base so a little bit of a bonus clip 13 v 13 with the super witches let me know what you guys are thinking about them we clutched up the perfect war with them we 13 v 13 super witches are going to be pretty fun moving forward but hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video don't forget to subscribe don't forget to leave a like you guys have a great day keep on clash bashing thank you so much for watching today's video if you did enjoy it don't forget to subscribe and turn on those notifications that way you don't miss any future uploads of mine and if you did happen to miss yesterday's video you can check it out right over there.